Okay, so let's just say you were interested in finding a very simple to set up jet for FPV flying. Then I think Zod might have come up with the exact thing that you're after. This is the Delta Strike. Now, out of the box, it comes, you know, so easy to put together. It basically clicks together and screws together, no glue required. It will take you minutes to put it together. They even provide a panning servo. I've not used that. I've used one of our uh, uh, gimbals that we 3D print and Jason sells on eBay when he can be bothered. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm not moving house. When he's not kids. moving house, having a child <laughs> and starting a new job, then he sells these on eBay. Yeah, it runs on four cells. So I've got a four cell 2200 pack and the air unit is for the DJI cam is on top of that uh, battery. So let's not hang around, let's get in in the air. Do you want to have a look at ins inside what I've got here? Yeah, there's plenty of room inside, isn't there? Yeah. So I've got my S FR Sky S8R receiver and there's my air unit. There's my 2200 four cell pack. <clears throat> so let's plug it in. Let the gyro sort itself out then plug in the in, I plug the air unit into the balance lead to power that. Just made up a little harness to do that. Now I'm not going to fly FPV for the first flight. <laughs> I recommend nobody does that. Uh, do a line of sight flight, get it trimmed out and fly nicely first. So I've got my goggles down here. So all I'm gonna do is plug those in and make sure it's recording. Ready? Yeah, it was a bit of a dicey hand launch, I have to say. I wrestled with it a bit, but I don't know why that was. And it's not really needed any trim. some strange roll characteristics. <laughs> there was anything wrong with your hand launch I don't think so we, we, we'll review it I, I don't think the think hand so. launch was fine it just it, it went one way then the other way and the, then the other way but and the CG I think is is on the money I don't know why that would be we will charge up the pack and next flight I think we'll get Jason to um, wear the FPV goggles and we've got head track we've got head tracking on the goggles now so uh, 
should be uh, some really impressive footage if we get it up in the air again. So, <laughs> so uh, for part one, thanks for watching. It was certainly interesting. I think it's going to need a bit of work, but uh, thanks to Jason on camera. Pleasure. And uh, if you enjoyed that, I certainly didn't, then please subscribe. And uh, you might want to click the bell icon for notifications of our future uploads and live streams. Otherwise, we'll be back for part two of the review of the Delta Strike very soon.